Well, a lawsuit leads to threats to life and property. Albany County filed suit this week against three furniture stores accusing them of defrauding taxpayers and providing people getting social service benefits with shoddy items. In one case, the county claims that a store sold mattresses that were infested with bed bugs. But now one of the other store owners is staunchly denying that she did anything wrong. She's also upset, she says, that the county didn't talk to her first before dropping a lawsuit at her feet and going after her for $25,000 in damages. She spoke only to our Matt Markham, who went to hear her side of the story just a short time ago. Matt? Liz, good evening. Virginia Spadaro owns AAA Furniture, which has been in the family for decades, she says, and it's one of the three stores the county is suing since receiving complaints from DSS clients who used vouchers to buy furniture there. In AAA's case, the suit claims some items delivered were broken and others weren't delivered at all, but Spadaro says it's all not true. Nevertheless, her phone has been ringing off the hook since yesterday, and some of the calls have been anything but cordial. Spadaro says she has the documentation proving that three complainants to the county did sign off that her store delivered everything ordered, and she told us AAA only sells new furniture from its store. Since the lawsuits were announced together, Spadaro says people believe her store is the one the county claims sold mattresses to DSS clients with bed bugs. The county's legal action also implicates two other stores, City Discount Furniture and 99 Cents and more. The latter store is the only one accused of selling beds with bed bugs to needy people using DSS vouchers. Spadaro says she's been working with DSS for 24 years and most of what she sells to voucher recipients is it cost? So there's barely any profit, but the fallout from the public, she says, has had a far greater cost. I have been threatened. Um, my family has been threatened. Uh, I've never slighted the public ever. And as far as bed bugs, we don't have bed bugs. It wasn't our store. I will definitely keep helping the community because that's what I've been doing all my life here. Now, Ms. Badaro also told me that anyone who comes in with a benefit card, regardless of whether or not they have a voucher, will be given a household item for the discounted price. And in some cases, it's a discount worth nearly $20. Albany County Executive Dan McCoy was unavailable for comment today, but his office stands by the allegations in the lawsuit, the investigation which led to its filing, and the determination to represent taxpayers and people in need fairly. Liz?